guys. It's the first time I'm vlogging today and it is 10 minutes to 6 at night. I had a migraine this morning and just not feeling that great so kind of been sleeping on and off today. Still got a lot of stuff to do around the house but I got all day tomorrow, all day Friday, and Saturday until the party starts, and I have people helping me on Saturday, so it'll all get done. Kevin just got home. Get one out of the drawer. Kevin just got home with some dead bird from the store, because I'm not doing any cooking until the day of the party, because I have to make some food for the party. And I'm just kind of, uh, How yeah. was that? You're kind of uh, like, really? What is it? Uh, it's very nice. Oh, my, my, my booze are getting balls. a little. Well, I can't put them back on with my, here. I got, <sighs> need two hands to put them back on. So, we're trying to film in really the only direction <sighs> possible. <laughs> I'll, I'll film your feet. <laughs> da, 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 da. That is actually part of what's wrong with me right now. I decided to wear my sneakers yesterday while I was doing decorating because everybody kept yelling at me, you're not supposed to be barefoot with your surgery. So I decided to wear my sneakers and this morning when I woke up, I could hardly walk. So, I gotta go back down to the doctors and get my feet checked again. Oh. Is that an injury? No! <laughs> it's not an injury. It's a recheck on a foot surgery. Yes, dear. Take away my 14, 15 days. <laughs> I'll beat you up. You have to catch me first. So Kevin Kevin made gourmet chicken tonight. I didn't make anything. I bought chicken. It comes in a bag now. It used to come in a little plastic container. Hold it up. I can't see. It's... Not that high! <laughs> and what else did we get from the store? We got... Swiffers. And pee pads for the critters. Oh, they did have some at? Yeah, they did. Smart and Final? Yeah. Or at uh, Stater Brothers. Smart and Final. Where did you get some? I don't know. My brain is not working. And some seafood penne. Because you ate all Seafood mine. penne. Because I ate all yours? What are you talking about? I wouldn't do that. Is there any left? No. Did I get to eat any of it? Freckles ate it. Blame it on the dog. <laughs> did you catch that? I did. What was that, Boomer? Are you too lazy to walk around? Yes, he is. <laughs> he was almost too fat to get underneath there. I got it. Okay, you guys are going to see a little bit of decoration. We moved the island in front of this doorway coming into the kitchen because when we have our party, we want everybody to come around because of certain reasons that we can't really show you. Um, but, so we have the island there on this side and we have some furniture on the other side that's kind of blocking it. And as you can see, we have the Beware of Zombies tape there as well. <laughs> and Boomer just squeezed his way under <laughs> under the the island there and he almost couldn't make it fat little cat <laughs> boomer's not feeling too good so kevin is giving him a little bit of loving yeah. he's handling this a lot better than bootsy did How are you buddy well bootsy's 14 he's four <clears throat> Or something like that. Ow. 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 Ow.
What are you doing, baby? I am making a prop for the Halloween party. Yay! And um, we're gonna be able to film it because you cannot figure out what I'm doing from what I'm doing here. Well, I'm not even looking at the pictures, so. Well, I've got lots of cardboard cut out in various shapes and sizes, and I'm going to be gluing it all together with a hot glue gun. Just quick and dirty. And, and are you using those plastic things? I will be using those plastic things. I'm going to have to uh, paint some of these with, a, with flat black paint. We uh, need some of, of those too for in the bathroom, you know. For why? To frame the thing that's hanging in the bathroom. Did you just decide that? I talked to you about that the other day. Okay. You don't remember me talking to you about that? Nope. I don't know what to do with him, guys. I talk, and I talk, and I talk. And he doesn't listen. She talks a lot. <laughs> it's hard to filter out what's important and what's not. Everything I say is important! How dare you! <laughs> important to you? Everything I say to him is important! Everything! There's nothing I have to say in this world that is not important! Really? That's true. Okay, well, maybe I'll start paying attention to you. You better. Okay. Well, have you seen my garage? It's about four feet high <laughs> in junk. I'd say it's a little over four feet, considering I'm 4'10 and two-thirds. <laughs> right, maybe that's about five feet at the at the peak there. No, because it's not there. over me. I turn on my TV, but I can't get to it. <laughs> you can't go in the house the, and out and around. <laughs> I don't know where the remotes are anymore because I don't touch your remotes in here. They're buried in this mess. I don't. Well, we had to move some of the house normal house furniture into the garage so we can put the Halloween furniture into the house. Yes, Halloween furniture. What's wrong with us? I don't know, but you yes, were supposed to... Yes, that pissing me off. Dollar in the cost jar! So now you got a $17 credit. You were supposed to build a long shed also because we have to put the Halloween furniture in the long shed when we're done with it, because otherwise it's just going to come back out here and... Well, what, when am I going to have time to do that? You don't need to sleep tonight, do you? Uh, I think I do. <laughs> I don't think you need to sleep. I think you can finish this project and then start on the shed. Tonight I'm going to start on the shed? Yeah. What time is it now? Eight? Nine? Ten? <laughs> I don't think it's I, that late. I don't know what time it is anymore. Well, I was just going to show them the hot glue that thingy that you were using. It's not more. like stuck down right. The corner's coming up. Get over it. <laughs> I'm taking my OCD self back in the house because me watching you do this is just going to stress me out. Okay. Goodbye. Goodbye. So you're out here working in the garage. It is October 28th. Yeah. And it is 77 degrees and it is 8 o'clock at night. I like it. That's why I live in Southern California. It's too hot. Miss New York. I want it to be cold. <clears throat> Why? And I'll be cold. 
And you won't let me turn the heat on. No, no heat. Heat's not good. Good for you. Heat's not good. It makes you strong. Heat's not good. Heat's very, very bad. I'm ready for shout outs whenever Kevin is, so. But I'm going to let him finish his project that he's working on. Yes. That you've been yelling at me to do. I never yell. I have no idea what you're talking about. You never yell. I never yell. I never raise my voice at all. <laughs> hey, everybody! It's time for... Shoutouts! You took too long. I know. Uh, I stuck my finger in his ear. You know what's coming, don't you? <laughs> you know what's coming. Hey everybody, um, first off, if all of our subscribers aren't already subscribed to Big D Jr., please go ahead and subscribe, but also his mother-in-law has been hospitalized with dementia. It came on very fast and very bad. She is not doing well at all. If everybody can please keep her in, her and the, her family in your thoughts and prayers. We would greatly appreciate that. Thank you and Big D, we're thinking of you. Yep. Katie Caroline said, if you don't at least try to do the, you are all part of our neighborhood community shout outs, it's a dollar in the cuss jar even though you're not cussing. No. You tell Katie. No. You stick to it, Katie. You keep no. keep it up, Katie. No, no. Keep it up. Right? Right. The spasmodic. <laughs> I I agree. Says I better watch out for for uh to be sabotaged since my I'm getting closer to my lobster dinner. He said I should watch out for things like banana peels on the floor, um radios next to the bathtub. Um, you know, things like that. I'm not paying for the dinner. How do I know the Crimson Fairy is not bribing you? Bribing me. Yes, bribing you. I don't think he, she needs to. I think you're probably end up falling on your own. Hey, I've done good so far. <laughs> Fifteen days, and I've been up and down ladders, and, and... How's your feet? My feet hurt. My feet really do hurt. I actually am going to go to the foot doctor early. I was supposed to go on the 4th. I'm going to go on Friday instead, this Friday instead, because they hurt. But that's not an injury. It's not an injury. Okay. Terry Johnson. I can only draw stick figures, too, but I have to tell you guys the story. You all saw Megan's artwork at the end of the vlog last night, um, or today, sorry, and <laughs> Terry Johnson says she can only draw stick figures. Well, Megan was about three years old, and my mom and dad came to visit from New York, and I was at work, and I get a phone call, and Megan is on the phone crying. I couldn't understand what Megan was trying to tell me. So my mother gets on the phone. I'm like, what's wrong? She's like, she's mad at me because I can only draw a stick figure and I can't draw like she can. <laughs> so Megan was really, really angry and upset with my mother because at three years old, Megan was born with this ability to draw because I can't draw a straight line with a ruler. So Megan got so mad. <laughs> it was so funny. And Vincent Gutierrez, you want to be an artist, you keep at it because Megan took lots and lots of practice and she is very, very talented, but it did take lots of, lots of time to get to where she is. So if you want to do it, you can do it. Just keep working at it. Oh, and I wanted to let everybody know that... The morning of November 2nd, there won't be no vlog posted. Um, that'll be a Sunday morning. Um, the 
vlog will go up on Monday morning, right? Something like that. Something like that. It's time for Neighborhood Community Credit Roll! Sorry, buddy. Can you point this thing in a different direction? Hey, well, <laughs> you upset for Boom Boom. We had somebody come to the door the other day, and Boomer snuck out the door, and I didn't see him sneak out the door. And then when I finally did see him, I'm like, Boomer, get back in this house. And Boomer came running in the house, and the guy said to me, did that cat just, like, obey? I'm like, yeah. <laughs> He's like, I've never seen a cat do that. So, Boomer's a pretty, he's not a normal cat. So, are you ready? Oh, God. Baby, you're... Boomer's not feeling well. I don't feel well either. You're gonna hug me and hold me and pat my belly? You okay, Boom Boom? Go ahead, do your thing. This is the guy who didn't ever want any animals, okay? None. Look at him. Boom, boom. Yeah, see. You are all part of our neighborhood community, each and every one of you. We would not be here if it weren't for you all. We love you. Thank you. Thumbs up. And we will see you all tomorrow. Bye. Boom, boom, bye, bye. <laughs>